WDAS 105.3. Now it's time to take the steps to get healthy, and we do it every day, and we do it every week. And it's with the Wellness in You with Fatima Gamble. Hi, Fatima. Hi, Mimi. It's a pleasure. We're going to talk about food cravings today. A lot of us have them. The holidays are coming, and so there's food everywhere you go. There's candy everywhere you go. You walk into a store, and the aroma kind of makes you hungry. Uh, Should we pay any attention to our food cravings? Well, yes, it depends on what, uh, what you're craving. If it's a sugar cravings, then um, it could be maybe a psychological or physiological um, comp- component. Then if that is the case, then um, you want to uh, check with your physician because um, if you're craving sugar, then that could have an adverse effect on your body. Yes. That could be... Obesity could be uh, obesity could Mm -hmm. result from it. Mm -hmm. Um, It could be um, cardiovascular disease or osteoporosis. So you really want to um, um, be careful if it is a sugar craving. And if it's um, say if it's something else, then it could be if it's uh, psychological, then it could be a form of depression. Wow. In. And if that is the case, then you really need to see a physician. Now, what about the craving of, of chips? Now, you mentioned sugar, chips and candy. Um, and you're it's craving something salty, and they are craving something sweet, or the combination of either one. Um, it, does that mean that we're really missing some kind of vitamin supplement? No, not necessarily. If you notice, uh, the salt cravings may come during a, a woman's certain time a month. Yes. And um, it's just that your your body is asking for for the sodium. Okay. But you must be careful in how you ingest and how much you ingest. Mm-hmm. Like if you're you're uh, craving chips, I mean that's normal. Yeah. You know we all do. I mean, it, not that I crave chips, but I like chips. I like chips. I also. like popcorn. You yeah. Know? Um, which are, but I tend to eat the chips that are organic, yes, natural and have low sodium. A low sodium. Okay, so that I'm not uh, infusing my body with um, too much sodium, which can be uh, detrimental to and your and health. And a lot of people don't realize that a potato chip is actually a sugar, turns into sugar, into the body. So if you're having some problems with um, too much sugar, you have to be careful of how many potato chips you eat, right? Uh, sure, sure. Yeah. You, know, you know, everything is in moderation. Right. You know, if you are craving something. But, you know, uh, I I kind of think, um, I tend to think that um, deprivation is, I think, worse than gluttony. Oh, so in other words, depriving ourselves? You know, when you (laughs) deprive yourself of something that you enjoy, it's just everything in moderation. I mean, you you, you don't be uh, over and you don't overindulge. Uh, That could be devastating to your health. Okay, is there anything that we could take? Say we're getting food cravings very often, and there's and we're just normal, there's nothing special going on. Is there anything that we could take to help curb that? Would it be a mint, or would it be a tea that can help curb those food cravings? Well, no, not really. No. Not really. It's, uh, if, you, if you desire it, then eat a small portion of it. That's but don't smart. eat it every day. Okay. You know, don't eat it every all day. <laughs> you know? I mean, you can sit and sit with a bag of chips, and you know, you can go all night with a bag of chips. You yeah. Know, if you aren't careful. Yes. But um, no, you know, I, I wouldn't suggest that. So, in other words, you're saying it's okay to have a piece of pie, a little bit of ice cream, a piece of cake. Or something that you really like, like a special treat, a homemade baked thing, sure. you know, that, that is special, or some chips every once in a while. But your point is, do it in... In moderation. You do it in moderation. I and mean, I mean, we all we all deserve, you know, a <laughs> snack here or there. You know, don't deprive yourself. I mean, that's... That, that works on your mental. I love that, Fatima. I love it. You can go to our website, WDASFM.com, and see the entire segment of The Wellness in You with Fatima Gamble. Fatima, always a pleasure. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you. That was fun. <laughs> I'm Mimi Brown on 105.3 WDAS, your adult mix.